So, Monique, how long has it been since you actually had sex? I don't know. Maybe on the night of Y2K. <laughs> I'm not gonna let you die alone. You're not? No. I'm sending you up with that guy. Greg. Greg? Which Greg? Could you pick someone with a less nondescript name? You know Greg from the IT department. <sighs> Come on, Mo. He's super cute and very smart. Come on, just give him a chance. I don't know. I think I'll just throw up a Craigslist ad and call it a day. No, 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 no. We're not doing that. You're going on a date with Greg. I don't know if I ever told you this, but he told me he thought you were cute. You're gonna have fun, Mo. I promise. So, Greg, how do you know Lindsay? Who? Lindsay? The girl who introduced us? Or, or a great one. Oh, really? That's interesting. When? Okay, do you know me at all? Uh-oh, what happened? That guy you set me up with was a total dud. And also, I'm not interested in your sloppy seconds. Okay, first of all, he's not my sloppy seconds because we didn't even sleep together. And second of all, how about a little gratitude over here? I mean, he was good looking, right? He paid with a gift card. I mean, not that there's anything wrong with that, but... You got what I mean. I feel wrong. Apparently. Monique, don't take this the wrong way, but do you feel sexually frustrated? No. Why would you say that? Because you seem like it. Also, you're crunching on ice. Textbook. So. Ugh, can I live? Listen, Mo, you got so many demands for a man, you might as well just try creating one for yourself. Let me know how that works out for you. Kristen, do you have a minute? Oh, hi, Monique. Sure, but I just can't be late. It's my engagement party tonight. Congratulations. So, what was it that you wanted to speak to me about? Oh, I think I'm ready to direct your company's research on the topic of 3D printing. Really? Well, you have demonstrated a great deal of knowledge in the field. I'll tell you what, I'll put you in charge of our next project, coding DNA sequences onto stem cells. Wow, great. It would be my pleasure. Just keep in mind that the technology is fairly new and still subject to glitches. I'll keep that in mind. Thanks, Kristen. Good luck.
help you? Are you Monique? Yeah. Are you looking for the perfect man? Uh, maybe. Why? Are you him? Yeah, I am. My name's Andre. Oh, come in, please. Technology is crazy these days, isn't it? You're telling me. So, is there a reason you've always been single? Well, I think it started when I was 14 and I went to this carnival and I was doing like bumper cars. And stuff. It was dangerous for both of us. It's definitely a tragedy. Yeah. Well, Andre, I'll be honest with you. I was expecting someone completely different. I may or may not have screwed up somewhere with the coding, but wow, I mean, I can't believe it actually worked, and I like you. You seem like someone I could get along with. I could see myself dating you. Wait a second, coding? What do you mean by coding? Coding, like computer coding. I programmed you and printed you out using 3D printing software. I'm sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm here responding to your Craigslist ad. Oh. Lonely girl? Always single? Oh yeah. I posted that. Yep. So, do you want to go out with me? Sure. Let me grab my coat. Andre? Yeah? How did you know where I lived? I hacked your email. I'm a computer programmer too. 